Hi everyone, welcome back. I'm away case with Whiskey Girl and today we're back with a real classic scotch and it's of course the Glenmorangie Original. This is a 10 year old matured on ex-bourbon casks and it's been matured for 10 years up in the Highlands near Tain which is uh, where you will find the distillery of Glenmorangie and they are of course known for having the tallest distills in Scotland. And another fun little thing, I think this is still accurate. So the Glenmorangie 10 is or at least used to be the most popular scotch single malt in Scotland so uh, it, so it just goes to show that this is the sort of whiskey that the Scotsman themselves likes to drink. I think this is a really funny expression. Um, it is of course a special distillery to me because it's one of my dad's absolute favourite distilleries. I uh, haven't been yet but I would love to go one day uh, and currently I also have a friend working up there so I might go up and see her, that would be absolutely amazing. But what's so fun about Glenmorangie and especially this 10 year old expression is that it always changes for me. We have a friend who's known for never being able to identify what it is because it always changes. You can give it to him one day and he'll say, oh, it's buttery and it's vanilla and it's candy and give him to the next day and he'll say, oh, it's quite dry, it's malty, it's uh, <laughs> this and that. And it's when he finds out the it's Glenmorangie 10, he'll always go like, oh, of course it is. Because it, it's such a, a tricky one for him. And I find that myself, I've tried it a few different occasions, and especially when you don't know what it is, it keeps changing. I know I did a review of that mystery box of whiskies that turned out to be Glenmorangie and Ardbeg a wee while back with our whiskey. And then I think I said it was quite green apples and fruity. Um, so I'm very excited to see what I'm going to see today. But of course, we're going to have a little nose. It's quite sweet today. This is about love about whiskey. Sometimes you just don't know what you're gonna get, even though you've tried it a few times, or even a hundred times. It's um, it's such a classic, but I don't know why it just keeps changing. Maybe it's um, Dr. Bill, their master blender, who's done something genius with it that it just keeps changing. Um, but I absolutely love it. Very sweet, very vanilla. Um, quite a crisp sweetness, like it's quite fresh sweetness and quite a sugary sweetness alongside that vanilla note and then underneath there's some sort of kind of malty, like almost hay, like dry hay note but let's have a little taste, plunge of it It's much maltier on the palate, I think. It's the sweetness toned down. It's still there in the back, but the malty note and the kind of dry hay note is what's on the tip of my tongue. It has this drying sensation, but it's also quite buttery and quite oily. And a bit nutty. Like, also when you, if you chew on almonds, you can get this kind of drying sensation in your mouth, it's kind of that. Along with that malty note that's quite drying. It's still quite juicy in a way. So it's, it's a drying sensation, like it tastes, the taste is dry. But the sensation is more mouth-watering. Because it still like, kicks off the saliva production, which sounds a bit gross. But it's, yeah, it's, it's, a, <laughs> it's a weird one. <laughs> I can definitely see why so many people absolutely love it.
Moon if you would consider when making purchases if you would like to use my links because uh, that way you'll help support the channel and I can keep growing my brand and making more entertaining and fun videos for you guys. But if you prefer seeing a little bit behind the scenes, a little bit sneak peeks and previews, feel free to become a part of my community on Patreon. That information is of course in the link below as well. And so is my details for my website or my Instagram if you're looking for that instead. I of course hope you've all had an absolutely wonderful day that you're getting some summery sunny days at the moment. But as always, I hope you'll have a wonderful day. Slendra